Good evening, my dear NEET 2025 warriors. Yes, what is the NTS comeback and why NTA might be on the revenge mode? There are three important points that we are going to discuss in this particular video. Starting off with, starting off with basically, you know, what, uh, how J can actually affect NEET and why will it affect it? And also, what is the new changing trend in 2025 back, yeah, if you compare it in 2024, 2023, what's the big difference? And also, how it's going to impact the upcoming NEET 2025, which is supposed to be the most competitive exam year. So make sure you are smashing that like button right now so that YouTube recommends you more NEET related content for your preparation and subscribe to the number one NEET English channel, right? So... We are here with Diksha ma'am and your Capto Shriya sir because we have been discussing the J mains paper live and Gopika ma'am was meeting all the students, isn't it ma'am? Yes, yes. I had been to the Bangalore center where I could speak to a lot of students and the best part is most of them were neat aspirants. So I know exactly what they felt while writing the physics and chemistry paper. Exactly. Yes. So Diksha ma'am, when you were discussing the J paper, I'm pretty sure that we have learned a lot. Definitely. And is there something that we are going to do for the students and uh, what is your learning? Can you just quickly let us know? So definitely guys, uh, as we have now four shifts of JE, now from that we can see that same questions were getting repeated but sometimes they are molded also in fact in different different shifts we can see the difference sometimes physical chemistry is slightly on a tougher side there are also mixed questions that can be asked directly copy paste in your neat exam neat 2025 so a lot of learning from that and okay. we will discuss that in we'll discuss that in detail now first point let me answer why J will affect NEET because usually when we talk about J NEET together, NEET students feel offensive or offended that, sir, Chuma, you are saying this, J is different, NEET is different. But don't think like that. Remember, NT is the common body which will set the paper for both. It is not different, number one. Okay, they have similar group of teachers and people who will be analyzing and setting the paper. Number two, similar changes are observed in the last five years, six years. Like, if there are optional questions given in J, there are optional questions given in NEET. If the difficulty has increased here it has increased if it has reduced it has gone down if there is a deleted portion here it is there here also similar changes in competition it has become more competitive it's not like one is increasing one is decreasing the syllabus, is as it is copied. syllabus is exactly copied the reduced syllabus completely based out of ncrt also rank inflation was observed in NEET 2024 it was also observed in j 2024 that's the reason why you should be worried of j it will definitely create an impact on NEET. Okay, so let's talk about the changing trends in NEET 2025. Sir, I think uh, before we go to just telling that, I think you should also give them an idea about what do we mean by this terminology because it's a very strong term about this pre-COVID pattern. Okay, pre-COVID pattern means basically before COVID, what happened is there were no optional questions. The timing was not 3 hours, 20 minutes. Also, the syllabus was not reduced. Also, but this time syllabus is going to be reduced. Maybe for 2026, it might come back to the original one. Also, the difficulty was decent enough. It was not very lengthy, very difficult, but it was some standard paper where you cannot easily score very high marks. So there were very few students with very high marks and on the same marks, you won't have thousands of students with the similar rank. That is what is different in the pre-COVID era. And now what we are seeing now is that in J, Maths is the deciding difficult subject in NEET ma'am, biology. It's going it? to be biology. And one thing I noticed from every student is that everything, be it physics and chemistry, it came from NCRT. Right. Now, if I go to pre-COVID era and since we have been solving questions from 2018-19 and all, you should understand that the biology is going to be conceptual. You cannot just read NCRT and just go and write it. It's not going to be possible. No Tukka strategy will work. You need to know the basic foundation of the chapter really well to answer the pre-COVID era questions. Correct. If you talk about... Uh, Physics paper, the physics paper had critical questions, analytical thinking was required. That means you need to analyze, oh, this is happening, that is happening. You need to think one step more. It's not like it's going to be like J-Advanced, very difficult. No, some level of thinking is required. It is not very, very direct. There were easy questions, but the number of average or moderate questions has increased. If you talk about chemistry, ma'am, 
so i'll just divide the chemistry very easy for you first thing is organic chemistry directly questions are asked from naming reactions but it's not like one naming reaction it's a to b b to c c to d these kind of chain sequence kind of questions are asked and don't amines is the most important chapter here next is from inorganic chemistry directly ncrt based questions are asked directly ncrt lines has been asked to you and about physical chemistry uh, it is still skeptical because in first three shifts it was very simple questions very directly formula based question but today in the fourth shift it was slightly on the tougher side so i need to even see next two shifts to comment on that thing i can't comment just directly it was easy or also difficult. some of the physical chemistry questions were mixed with organic or right. physical was mixed with inorganic yes that is what has been seen and sometimes more organic is asked or sometimes, sometimes more, more, more physical, physical is asked yes okay so you need to be prepared for everything and one more thing guys practical chemistry salt analysis not yeah. any question has this been asked from that uh, lasagne's test has been asked repeatedly in all the shifts so that is also important thing yeah so remember practical physics and chemistry was the newly added topic in both physics and chemistry but surprisingly even in neat even in j it has not been asked so hopefully nt has forgotten but we don't know i mean don't break your head over it but keep it as a safer side just do it but don't think that okay pakka it will come i would say just give 30 to 40 minutes of salt analysis just go through the our, our one shot lectures that's it yeah next important thing is distribution is even older trends may not apply like for example if you talk in physics many people are thinking electromagnetic induction 100% questions will come no that is not true anymore okay suddenly things have changed suddenly ray optics they are asking more suddenly units and dimensions they are asking more questions so some uh, you know changes are there in the weightage so guys don't just follow blindly skip these 10 chapters or just do only these five chapters if you watch such videos there is a good chance you might very well regret it i would also like to add one more thing as sir said the don't skip any chapter reason being from some chapters direct very simple very laddu question has been asked yeah. it will be like just one second tick so don't skip any topic don't skip any chapter don't skip any chapter go through that least basics of you never know from that direct question has been asked Correct. very true also more application and multi-concept based questions and also the paper is going to definitely check your understanding as well as knowledge and your random strategies which you might find on youtube will not work like tukka strategy might not work chuma finding five chapters or five topics might not work keep all these things in mind so multiple concept questions can definitely come in your physics as well as in chemistry now how will it impact yeah more strongly on biology biology though for sure for because sure. that is what is going to uh, be the most important subject when you are going to be in a doctor or in medical sciences exactly. now how will neat 2025 be impacted first of all let me tell you the number of droppers are increasing and the serious droppers are increasing because they don't want to take a chance in 2026 because 2026 will be way different exam because there will be enough time for nta to prepare and change the pattern nobody wants to take another drop so everybody is going to give their full full 100 percent effort in need 2025 yeah. what about the cutoff uh, so I would say from what I understood is that uh, maths paper was a little hard on the first yeah. shift. Just so I think time. again here also biology might be the deciding factor. But again, it we cannot predict that it will increase, decrease. But we could say that if you are a serious aspirant, then let me tell you, it is going to remain the same. But if you're not serious, the non-serious ones will not be able to cross that easily like how it was in 2024. Yes. That is what I believe from what I understood from students' response. Yes, Definitely. correct. Tukka means the guesswork. Guesswork yeah, will not fluke. work. Fluke. In yeah, that, yeah that will not work. And section B may be there, but it might not have options just like in J. We don't know. We'll wait for the brochure. Also, the cutoff will reduce to the pre-COVID era because the papers were of standard level so the 2020 before years whatever were there similar trends might be observed but the problem is number of students serious aspirants are increasing so and they have better access remember before covid youtube was not so popular online classes were not so popular now every village every town every student is preparing really well with the best teachers so that is the reason why the cutoffs can again increase in spite of the paper being of standard level which is 
वेरी बैड न्यूज फॉर एन एवरेज और स्लाइटली अबाउ एवरेज स्टूडेंट बिकॉज आई है प्रिपेयर वेल बट स्टिल यू नो आई एम सींग दैट मेनी अदर स्टूडेंट्स आर डूइंग मच बेटर देन मी फॉर अ डिफिकल्ट पेपर नाउ ऑल्सो कीप इन माइंड मेनी नीड स्टूडेंट्स डिड यू नॉट फाइंड इट मैम येस येस सो स्टूडेंट्स आई वॉज रियली शॉक्ट वेन आई वेन दर मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स वर नीट एस्पिरेंट्स एंड दे टोल मी मैम वी अटेम्प्टेड मैक्स इट्स नॉट लाइक दे डिड नॉट अटेम्प्ट बट दे गेव ऑल देयर कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ऑन फिजिक्स एंड केमिस्ट्री एंड दे अंडरस्टूड दैट एवरीथिंग इज एनसीआर टी बेस्ड हाउ दे हैव टू प्रिपेयर एंड वी हैव अ लॉर्ड ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स ऑल्सो टेलिंग यू नो हाउ दे वॉन्टेड टू चेंज दे पैट and like they want to solve more uh, theoretical more uh, you know numericals in physics and when it comes to chemistry they wanted to concentrate more on reactions wow. yeah. they wanted yeah. to write Actually, when you are in that exam hall now you know other conditions as well how invigilator is treating you right. so you know you need to change your pattern how to manage the time all these things exactly. also count so that is a big shock and i think that is also to make you people understand that when we talk about mock test also you people take it very lightly but there are other aspirants who are writing je exam just imagine even as a backup 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 and also another thing is when difficulty increases imagine for the same score many students will not have the same rank like remember so many students got 720 rank uh, sorry 720 marks or so many all india ranks uh, so many people at the same score that will not happen that means one one mark will make a huge difference keep this in mind all right so now it's very important that you kick start your preparation with us in the neat english batch which is the neat express 2.0 the link is there in the description box with live classes with notes with test series with dpps with test analysis with the soft copy material whatever you need and if you want the pen and paper mode we are going to courier you the 20 omr sheets along with the 20 full length mock tests in the combo neat express 2.0 but if you want even the hard copy material not just the soft copy go for the pro along with the test series you will get the pro so this is how it looks like the omr sheets and our test papers which will be couriered to you for a better environment for understanding the environment of how the actual exam feel is going to be like and this neat express batch let me tell you right now 1000 plus students have enrolled in it and already they are ahead so you don't want to be falling behind and you will be studying with the best team with us okay so also you'll be getting recorded classes after the sessions are over and we ensure that you succeed 100% yes. and now the most important announcement why we have not done a neat session on the questions which were asked in j which will be helpful for neat i want everybody to comment in the comment section that sir we wanted and the reason why we are waiting is because there are more shifts yet to be completed we will analyze all those shifts and we will come up with a session just for you so if you want us to do that session comment below we want a neat questions based on j उटरे So physics and chemistry if you want the session please comment yes write it down in the comment section because that is going to be very very important for you because the conducting is agency is same that is nta the teachers are same paper setters are same so you you never know by just changing some digits over there you will get the same question in your neat exam so that is going to be very important we will analyze all the six shifts and that will be done okay, okay. do not forget to smash the like button and comment below thank you so much thank you for liking share it with all your friends okay only if you like and see the comments we will be doing it thank you